Hello, hello, hello everyone, Zojin here with another episode of Depraved. So I looked it up, here's the working area, I can change it. Oh my god, I feel so dumb now. How about, let's hunt for man. Hunt those banditos and freaking kill them all. Bandits, kill the bandits. So that's how you change the working area, okay. What's going on here? Why do not automatically assign it? Did I run out of people? I don't think so. Goods, firewood, stone mason. We got a tailor here, put the stones and the working parts and there's, oh my God, there's a bear right here with some beets. Bro, can you like get the rest of those meats or something? Laborer, oh, you're getting that water, yo. That's good. Can we get somebody to like move these away? Consume. Where's the hunter? Oh, you're hunting the animals, not the bandits. Okay. Let's try attacking the bandit. This is crazy, but let's do it. Oh shit, who's this guy? <laughs> the carpenter is automatically attacking him too. Oh! Oh shit! A wolf is killing them! Did he just surrender? No, don't gather the freaking wolf meat. Oh no, he was murdered. Do we get a hundred dollars on that? I don't know. <laughs> Finish him off, you're already half dead. <gasps> a Winchester. Oh no, I wasted that bullet. I mean, that gun, shit, that was probably bad, but he's probably gonna die soon. So how is this gonna work? Do I get a free gun every time I get a hunter? Cause I don't have any inventories of guns. I can always buy them, of course. Um, where's the hunting lodge? Let's go get him, where is he at? Does he automatically have a weapon? No. Needs a rifle? Oh crap, we ran out. So what happened to the other? Oh shit, he's dead. Yes, we can get some Colts, some free Colts. Um, how about you laborer, get that Colt. I mean, I don't think it matters. Lumberjack. Get that coat. Since you're actually going outside in the woods, it'd probably be better if you get it. Cause of death murder. Cause of death murder. Cause of death bandit. Okay, so I might actually have to buy some weapons. Undertaker, Doctor, Cemetery. Do I actually need that Undertaker and Cemetery? I don't know. Let me build the other stuff first. Do you guys get the weapons yet? Bam! You got some weapons. And we're just gonna let these corpses ride around because I don't I'm pretty sure it doesn't do anything. Friendly fox? Oh I guess it I means the fox won't attack. 
normally. Can you get the meat? Where's the hunter at? Okay, he is harvesting goods. Okay, that's good to know. Why is this asleep? Because there's no worker here. You don't have plenty of workers, I'm pretty sure of it. Stone will be delivered, a green farm, and it will be sufficient for money. I mean money, for food. With the grain and plenty of hunting to do. Woodcutter. Lumberjack. Oh, all these trees are almost gone, maybe. Chop some woods over here. Have you been near the hunter during your excursions? Probably have too many outhouses. So what's gonna happen with this horse? Do I want a horse or something? Mount a horse. Oh, you bring it to the stable. Now the stable won't starve. Thank you. Sheep farm. Breeds sheep and generates wool. That's going to be useful for clothes, I think. Supplementary feeding. Eighty percent bad, ten percent good. What the hell does that mean? I guess it's basically the fertility. In this case, lower is better. basically farmland okay let's see we got 17,000 oh we're losing my monies because so we're gonna need to build some shacks can we sneak in the shack over here maybe no Is it because of those roads? I hope not, but that's gonna be a problem if I can't build over roads in the future. Just fill up this place with shacks if I can. That way I can get more monies and more workers. And that's all I can build, pretty much. Or I can build one over here, too. Bam! Gonna have so much shacks, so much monies. Shacks, like Shaq. <laughs> Shaquille O'Neal. <laughs> that's not what I mean, but yeah. And then I'll expand. Because it only costs $5,000. And if I build up my economy, it'll be easier to get that $5,000. Expand territory, $5,000. I don't, I don't think I need new settler wagons. Although it might be, it's probably cheaper to get more settler wagons. Is this just like, a, is this just for every city or? I mean, maybe each city will have its own economy, but yeah. So it'll probably be cheaper to just Get a cellar wagon. You know what? Let's get it. Let's build a new city, y'all. Um, actually, let's 
Do I want to be close to my current city or... What is this? That's the railroad. Okay. So maybe I want to build it near the railroad. Okay, let's see. That's too many dangerous animals. So how about over here? Like, there's the railroad, there's stone, and there's some trees over here. It's not that far off from my building. So we're going to set up a new town over here somewhere. Is this a settler thing? Right, I need to leave room around the railroad so I can build a thing. But I don't want to... Yeah, I think I could just plop it down like over here or something. Yep, that's going to be our new city. I did not really plan that out. I just see it's near some s stones, some trees. Actually, I don't know. Is that too far away? Would it over here be better? Because it's a nice wide open spot. You know what? I can always, you know, get another one. I, I mean, $2,500 is a lot cheaper than $5,000. So yeah, that's pretty much all the time that we got for this episode. So hopefully everyone's enjoying this series. Oh, Forester! We can plant trees, that's good. Yeah, be sure to let me know down below. Subscribe, comment, rate the video. As always, thank you for watching. Until next time, I have no room for to put this. I'll have to delete a shack. Let's see if we can do that. Destroy. Yep, we got that shack. We got that Shaquille O'Neal. Bam. Okay. Bye, bye, everyone. Thanks for watching. Bye. <laughs> bye.